Okay guys, welcome to another episode of the Artsy Trio. So this is this month's mood board. If you would like a copy of the mood board and maybe share whatever you do inspired by the mood board um, with me and the other teachers, uh, Mike Deacon and Bea Grob, um, you can join our Facebook group, uh, Artsy Trio, which is linked down below. Um, all right, so this month I am responsible for the mood board and um, I'm really inspired by the colors of nature at the moment and um, I want to do another experiment. I think it's going to be something sort of abstract. I'm not actually sure at the moment of filming this, but I guess we're going to find out together, right? I'm going to use my jelly gouache and I'm going to pick out some appropriate colors and we'll see where we go. Um, this is my journal that I do lots of art experiments in and we're going to just Take it one color at a time. All right, let's see where we go with this and I'll be right back. Okay, after sitting on it last night and thinking about it, I haven't edited the video yet. Um, I thought I would give some further explanation to what I did with this month's Artsy Trio uh, mood board. So I've been endlessly fascinated, I would say lately, but it's not lately, um, with the idea of mid-century modern abstracted kind of art. And I know lately I have been seeing lots of home decor DIYs um, that are inspired by said art. And I actually, a few years ago, designed a line of stamps and stencils that are in my Etsy shop, which is linked down below, um, that are in that same vein. And my friend Mike Deacon has some stuff too over in his shop. I'll link his shop down below. Um, so as soon as I saw this month's mood board, for whatever reason, I decided to go that way, probably because I did this triptych recently. Hang on. Seriously, hang on. <laughs> So I did this triptych recently. These are six by six canvases and it is for sale in my Etsy shop. Again, the link for that, my shop is down below. And um, I think because I just finished this piece, it was still in the back of my mind and I wanted to do some further exploration um, with this kind of abstracted idea. Um, I did use some of my um, stencils for this piece and I did um, film it. And uh, at the moment, I can't remember if it's on this channel or if it's on the Patreon only channel, I don't know, but um, it was a pretty easy piece to do and it was done in the same idea as the video you're about to watch. So anyway, that's where my thinking was for this month's mood board and that's where I went with it and I had a lot of fun with it and I will be doing some further exploration with this. I hope it gives you some ideas of what you can do. Now let's get started.
I would love to see where you guys go with this, and I can't wait to see what Bea and Mike do with it. Um, if you do post something in the Facebook group, please tag me in the post so that I can see it, and like and comment. And I hope that you guys have fun with this month's challenge. Uh, go out and stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Make some fun art and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.